Hi, Mother Truckers. BP Hero back at you today. I've been working with the evil one for my guy, Bob Russell. Everybody knows from the OG softball fans days, Bobby Bugs, the mad scientist. Been working with another mad scientist. Unless you've been living under a rock, then you're probably well aware by now that Chris and the gang over at Pure and Bobby and the gang over at Evil put their heads together to produce what you're seeing here, which is going to be called the Pure Evil. ASA, USA, whatever you want to call it these days, softball bat. Evil's been a big supporter of the channel for years when it comes to softballs, bats. Uh, you got us the Blue Flame pitch machines you guys just see in the videos all the time before I put Brian on the payroll. He's been a huge help to the channel over the years and a good friend of mine. So for me to be able to kind of help uh, him collab and get together with Pure, he would asked me a lot of questions about what bat should he use, who should he go with. Uh, this was my recommendation. These two put their heads together to make a good product, and here we are swinging it, and I'm going to tell you, I think he's got a good one. These will be released for pre-order. I'm hearing Friday. Don't mark me on that for sure, but look look, for, look at Friday for a pre-order to be released at Pier's website, also on Evil's website. And let's take a quick look at the specs on this thing and what they will be available in just to kind of give you a rundown of what we're dealing with here. So this thing is going to be featuring a 13-inch barrel, which has been Evil optimized. A little bit of a variation change from the Hellfire that we're all used to. This will come in balanced, half ounce, and full ounce of inload. Same composite handle that they've been using on the Hellfires. But the biggest change here has been in the design of the PAD technology that has been evil optimized. Not sure if I'm at liberty to discuss any of that stuff. I'll let Bobby cover that when those bats hit the market. And I will say this is a production prototype. It's stamped. It's on the list. This is the bat that will get out to the customers, this particular one you're seeing in the videos. It will be different. Uh, here is the paint scheme that he's going with for the first round of the bats. And real quick, we're going to look at compression here while we're pulled away from the field. He sent this to me a couple weeks ago, and weather and things happening, we just were never able to get out and hit with this thing. I finally got tired of it and took it out to league one night and hit it fresh out of the wrapper. Here it is compression testing at 1,500, and I took the wrapper off of it, hit about 15 minutes with the ground balls to some people before the game that night, and then took it out and right out of the wrapper, hit two home runs, screaming exit speed through the infield. Whatever changes he done to this thing have been good ones. It started out great and it's done nothing but get better since then. Just kind of a quick short and to the point, uh, look at this bat. It's not like a full review or anything. Uh, I'm sure that we will be able to get our hands on one of these once production hits and everything will be available. So we can get some more swings on this and see uh, what these two have came up with for some changes. So Bobby can have his own twist on this thing. Big thanks to Bob Russell for sending this out to me. Big thanks to Pierre for getting it directly to me and very quickly. Thanks to you guys for checking out the video. Like I said, stay tuned. There will be a full review coming of this thing once it gets its full cosmetic stuff done. Bobby's wanting this thing so you can pass it around down the league down there. So we didn't have a ton of time to break this thing in. Not like it needed it anyway. But stay tuned to the Evil Facebook page. He's been posting all kinds of stuff on there. So I hope you enjoyed this quick little video here, guys. Swing hard in case you hit it. Keep here. I'll catch you next time. Or you just hit him in the face. Well, because, like. Yeah, I mean, that was a. I jammed myself just a little bit. But it's nasty on the just go get it spear.
keep hitting him like that, I'll keep throwing him a foot short. <laughs> oh, yeah! Huh. That's just where I hit the ball. <laughs> Finish Grigori. Oh yeah. His next gear. Yeah, that's I was kinda <laughs> thinking it towards the end of my round, but you you hit that one BP ball and I was like, damn, okay. And I just hit that BP ball. The, the one that hit off the in the air? Yeah. Yeah. We were on the same page. Yeah, it hit another gear. <laughs> 